Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh and hi everyone. My name is Nur Amirah binti Misrar and today I'm gonna talk about Myers Briggs Type Indicator, which is also known as MBTI. Before we go even further, let me introduce to you what is MBTI. The Myers Briggs Type Indicator or MBTI is a self-help assessment test or self-indicator which helps people gain insight about how they work and learn. It is a framework for relationship building, developing positivism, and achieving excellence. Let me share some facts about MBTI. First, MBTI is started by Catherine Cooks Briggs and her daughter Isabel Briggs Mayer. Second, it is actually based in United States in early mid 20th century. And this indicator is actually inspired by Swiss secretaries named Carl Jung. Categories of MBTI There is four assigned categories of MBTI. First, introversion or extraversion. Second, sensing or intuition. Third, thinking or feeling. And fourth, judging or perceiving. It is said that one and each of us actually own a dominant from each categories. Now, let us proceed with MBTI type. There is 16 types of MBTI that comes with 4 letter code. For example, I stated here 4 only and the rest you can check later. First, ISFJ which is also known as the protector. Second, ENTP. It is also known as the debater. And third, INTP, the thinker. And last but not least, ENFP, also called as the champion. For those who question how MBTI differs from other instruments, Actually, MBTI is not really a test. There are no correct or wrong answers, and one type is no better than any other type. The objective of the indicator is not to assess mental health or to provide any type of diagnosis. Also, unlike many other types of psychological assessments, your results are not comparable to any norms. Instead of looking at your score in relation to other people's scores, the purpose of the instrument is simply to provide more knowledge about your own specific personality. That's all from me. Thank you.